We are now being isolated, becoming isolated. The farm is located in the center of five Israeli settlements. No electricity, no water, and no building permit. And this is, of course, the story of many, many other Palestinians who are in the same situation. According to Dawood Nassar, too many young Palestinians faced with difficult and demoralizing situations resort to violence, accept despair, or move away. Dawood and his wife Jihan Nassar believe in another option, a fourth way. We are people who believe in human rights and we believe in justice. And we, we believe that one day the sun of justice will rise again. So this brought us to the concept of the fourth way, which is a non-violent way of resistance. And our slogan is, we refuse to be enemies. And this is what I call it today, the fourth way of a non-violent resistance. At the Carter Center's 2018 Restoring Faith and Freedom Human Rights Defenders Forum, Daoud and his wife Jihan spoke about their strategy in response to the difficult situation they are facing in the West Bank. The land was bought by my grandfather in 1916, and he registered the land. It was under the Ottoman rule at that time, so we got papers from the Ottomans, and then my father and uncle kept re-registering the land during the British, the Jordanians, and even we have documents after 1967 from the Israelis. So the land is fully registered from 1916 until today. So we faced, and we are still facing difficulties, legal difficulties, but we are still there. Confronted with this intense opposition, the Nassars found a way to apply their Christian faith and their concept of the fourth way of non-violent resistance to bring hope to young people. They created Tent of Nations, a family farm that develops skills and creates a connection to the land. And with the Tent of Nations, we want to invest the frustration that we have in a positive way. Because when people get frustrated, they become angry and they react negative. For us, we said like we want to convert the negative energy that we might have in a positive way. No electricity, we install the solar power system. No running water, we depend on rainwater. No building on the ground, we started building under the ground, renovating existing caves. And we became like an educational environmental farm. The Nassars want people of the world to come to Tent of Nations to see the land, hear their story, learn new skills in alternative energy and organic farming, and then share their experiences far and wide to build a community of nonviolence. Of course, and sometimes some people might think nonviolent way of resistance is a weakness. No, it is a strength, and we are acting differently because of our faith. So that's why the foundation of the work that we are doing there is faith, love, and hope.